What happens when you mix the community, lossless scaling, and the Steam Deck? Well, you get something special. In this video, I will show you how to install lossless scaling in your deck. There are many reasons why the Steam Deck is king right now in the hard hair market. But the community is the most important part because the Steam Deck is king mainly to the how they be able to create amazing mods and really improve how the handheld performs. Lossless scaling is game changing. It allows you to make your LCD Steam Deck so good that it can stand the test of time. I'm hoping that Steam OS developers takes advantage of this mod and improve something that already works well, making it simple to use for everyone that owns an OCD or even an OLED deck. It's not hard to install your deck, the only thing you need is lossless scaling from the Steam Deck store. It costs $7 and honestly, this will be hands down the best $7 you ever spend, trust me. After that, you need to get the key loader and the lossless scaling BK mod from GitHub in order for this to work. Let's go for it. With this mod, you will be able to double your frames per second and have better performance on your games. Step 1. Press the Steam button, go over power, and switch to desktop mode. Now that you are in desktop mode, Step 2. Go to the browser, search, and download Decky Loader. I recommend placing it on your desktop so it's easy to find later. Step 3. Go back to your browser, grab Lossless Scaling Beacon Mod from GitHub. At the same time of this upload, they are a pre release version, but I recommend getting the version that is 0.10.10 and download it. Hey people, I noticed while I was editing the video that they released a newer version, version 0.12.1. I recommend to use this version instead of 0.10.10 uh, because it's a newer version and there's no difference between the, the previous version and this version. All right, my brother, let's get back to the video. Step 4. Now it's time to install the key loader. Run the installer. I recommend using the stable Steam OS version. Wait for it to finish installing and then switch back to gaming mode. Step 5. Let's set up the key loader correctly. Press the three docs button, head down to the plug icon and go to the gear icon on the top. On the general tab, enable developer mode in the key loader. Step six, go to the developer tab, select install plugin from zip file, browse to your download folder and click on the decky lossless scaling BK zip. To install it. Once installed, open the Decky Loader menu and click on the Lossless Scaling. You need to install both Lossless Scaling BK and Lossless Scaling from here. Click on Install Lossless Scaling BK. Once it's done, get the Lossless Scaling app from the Steam Store if you haven't already. After downloading and install on your Steam Deck, there is one more thing you need to do in order to work properly. Head over Manage, Properties, Betas, and under Beta Participation, choose Linux Testing. If you need to update lossless scaling, do so. Now that is everything installed, there is one more final step. Final step. You need to set up a launch options for these to be enabled in your games. 
is quick and simple. Before starting a game, open Manage, Properties, General, Launch Auctions. You can copy the command from Decky Loader yourself. And that it, you're good to go. With lossless scaling installed in your deck, you can go from 40 to 45 frames per second to 75 to 80 in that space remake, running at 2x. And even more when you run at 3x, easily over 100 frames per second in most games. It's amazing how this adds a level of performance that is truly game changing. I recommend tweaking your settings for each game depending on your performance. For my LCD Steam Deck, I like to keep it between 75 and 90 frames per second. But remember, it's all personal preference and depends how much your game look and feels. In Mecha Break, Lossless scaling makes the game so much more enjoyable and playable. At 3x scaling, it runs between 100 and 120 frames per second. And honestly, the input lag isn't that bad. Pretty impressive for this game. You don't need to go higher though. At 2x, it's perfectly fine. With this mod, if you feel your game are not performing well, this is the edge that can give you that perfect performance for all your games and everything else. Lossless scaling is supporting this handheld in a way that makes it unbeatable. Thanks to the community and mods like lossless scaling, the Steam Deck keeps proving why it's still the best handheld out there. If you find this video helpful, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and hit the bell so you don't miss any future videos like in this one. And I want to hear from you. Have you tried lossless scaling in your Steam Deck? And if you did, what kind of friends boost do you get? Drop your results and thoughts down below in the comments. I'd love to see what you got. Thank you so much for watching. See you next time.